they are together like this to form a polymer of n units so this polymer is n units long these bonds on the right and left they are called continuation bonds just to show that uh, just to show that the molecule is continuing on both sides and this is a repeat unit of the polymer so this was ethene the monomer was ethene and the polymer was polyethene and that's exactly what you use in your homes uh, it's you call we call it polyethene as well but it's it is actually polyethene so whenever now you see a plastic bag what uh, it is polyethene that you're using so we can also have a, a different monomer so we can have a monomer where there is a chlorine atom over here now when this polymerizes we will get a polymer with the repeat unit of this we get this polymer this is a repeat unit of the polymer and if you have to draw several repeat units then we start again from here keep repeating it keep going on like this so we can draw as many repeat repeat units as we as we want so in if you if you want to count the number of repeat units over here 1 2 3 and 4 four repeat units in total so this is how we make these polymers so uh, this polymer was uh, this this monomer was vinyl chloride it's called vinyl chloride or chloroethene and the polymer is polyvinyl chloride and it's also known as pvc famously polyvinyl chloride it is used in pipes pvc so let's move forward now so the problem problems with the dispose, disposal of plastics now um the problem with these addition polymers is that they are non biodegradable which means that you when you throw them away they do not break down they take millions and millions of years to break down so basically they are just taking a lot of space when they are thrown away and as a result landfills keep getting used up so there is a, a lack of space because obviously you will dig a landfill uh, to throw waste in it and the plastic will just stay there so you will never have extra space to throw more stuff into it because the polymer will never degrade the addition the polymer will never biodegrade the addition polymer so so um it this is a big problem because we are running out of space for throwing our garbage and then when when they are burnt so some are actually uh, when there is no space to throw them away they are burnt but the problem is that when they are burnt they produce toxic gases so for example when polyvinyl chloride is burnt when pvc is burnt then hcl ga gas which is hydro hydrogen chloride gas is produced and that's very toxic so it can be harmful to us humans and for animals now birds they cannot digest these plastics so when birds try to eat these plastics they they can get choked on them and their stomach also fills up and because it never digests so they can actually die and the plastic settle on the ocean floor and this causes problems for aquatic life so we should th that's why they say we should always try to recycle plastic because uh because so that these problems don't happen so this was the end of the chapter we have covered everything in the in in hydrocarbons so you should practice papers now at gcguide.org the link is in the description and you can email me your doubts at a level chemistry free at gmail.com the email id is also in the description keep practicing keep watching and stay tuned thank you